Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. Today we are heading back into the special episode. I'm really not sure what is left. I know there is some amount because last episode we got level 16 done, Wingo's Double Trouble. Now we're moving on to the Hunt Continues, which seems to just have two levels in it. I'm guessing that it might not be a very long episode. We'll find out together. But first off, let's do level 17, Crown Capture in Wandering Woods. So we got five crowns to capture, three diamonds to get, and booze to defeat. Uh, That'll be interesting because we've done the boo capturing ones or the boo destroying ones, I suppose, and we've also done the crown capturing ones, but this is sort of a combo of both of them. So it's surely going to be interesting. What I don't notice is any kind of, I don't currently, hmm, have any kind of cherry to help me out here, but I do see one over that way. So what it might be best, I'm not gonna be able to grab that for right now, which is fine. Oh no, let's get rid of these guys. Oh, so they sort of disappear after a while. I need to get the cherry. That's what's gonna be the big difference maker here for me. So grab that, plop back down this level, or this area of the level. I do remember this level though. It was a bit tough to begin with. What if I go up here? Anything interesting happening? Okay, so let's grab on the here, yep, okay. Pick this up, this is probably, okay, no, it's just one up. All right, so that wasn't exactly what I was looking for in terms of some stuff. Oh no, that actually hurt you. I forgot that they were spiked like that. I thought they would just push you away. Huh, all right. I don't really know if there's anything around here exactly I need to get, but I do see another poster right there. I don't know if it's gonna be one of those like, hey, find the three posters. So I'm just taking a look around. It looks like you know most of this is destroying the ghosts along the way. So now that I've destroyed the ghosts that pop up here, as you can see, they still pop up again now. So our best bet for right now is just to plop down this way, go ahead and get rid of as many ghosts as we can, grab that, and find out the next one's over that way. Uh, what's in here? Uh, that was 10 coins, okay. So I would need to go over this, oh wait, 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 diamond, over this way. Hold on, hold on. Got him, got him, got him. All right, what is happening? Okay, the ghost, the booze popped up and then they went away. <laughs> Let's try it again, now that, we're, now that we know where we're going, we can actually skip out on some of these guys. Just because they seem to just respawn as soon as you try to grab some more of them. Luckily they still give you coins every time, which is nice. There we go, so we know our next one is over this way. I just need to get rid of some of these booze and uh, get up this way. So we got the diamond associated this one pretty easily. The next one's over there and the diamond's over that way. Come on, there we go. So I just need to plop down here in just a second. And then, oh, big boo. Oh, okay, we almost got hit there, that was a little scary. So this is where it gets tough. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to do this, am I? I'll try it. Oh, so close yet so far. That's okay, that's okay, we, we can do it now. I'm glad we just got the second diamond. That was sort of a big focus, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. We can ignore most of these guys now, so that makes it a heck of a lot easier. And then, oh, turn around, what are you doing? I don't know what that was about. Come on, come on, you guys are going down. And then our next crown is over this way. I can dodge these guys, no problem. That's it, got only got a couple more seconds, so if I could just do that and then turn around on him, that was excellent actually. And the tough part now is actually finding the third diamond. I think, ow, what is wrong with me? I just ran right into that. So if I could just grab this and look around a little bit, the next diamond is over there. So the best way to get that, of course, is to do that. And then actually getting, oh, I see what I was supposed to do. Uh, well, I didn't quite do it. Let me grab this. I'm gonna have to do the whole thing again because there's no way I can really reach it from here. And I ran into the boo. So I'm gonna have to do it all over again. That's sort of silly. <laughs> Not good. No way, okay, I got the three diamonds. Never mind. I had thought that uh, I would have had to. Okay, let me gra grab that for now. <laughs> but um, I would have had thought that I would have had to get the diamonds again. Luckily, I didn't. I mean, it'd probably still be easier to get rid of some of these guys before I get started with the crown, but we'll try it one time and see how it goes. Come on, get rid of these guys just like that and grab that before it disappears. Come on, come on, got it. Run them back this way, nice. So this one isn't too bad. This is crown number four. Wait, wait, really, did he get taken out there? That's weird. And I just gotta wait here for a second, let this move me over. Got it. 
So yeah, this is sort of a weird spot, but we've, we've gotten this figured out before. All I gotta do is wait right here, and boom, got it. And all the booze disappear, thank goodness. See, I do not know what the objective to this one was. Uh, yeah, I have no clue. <laughs> like usually these these kind, like maybe it's like, oh, only go through the pipes a certain amount of time or something like that. I really don't know. Like maybe it's not getting hit at all? That could definitely be something. Let's find out. But we got the three diamonds, we got the main mission. Didn't take any damage, awesome, because this time I didn't take any damage. Wait. Oh, but because I died, that doesn't count as its own take? That's sort of weird. So I do have to replay the level, but even I thought that it would restart it once I died because after that, I did not get hit at all. So let me just do it again real fast. Make sure I don't take it. Oh, you know what? I guess the second toad. That toad got hit. That might count as taking damage, so which is sort of silly if you ask me. Oh, there we go. Sort of a pain in the butt to work with, but I'll do what I can. Okay, so there we go. I got it done that time. Took a couple of attempts. It was not easy to do just because that second toad can drift off a lot with that area, so I just really had to focus in on it. But we got it done. Definitely didn't get hit whatsoever in that level, so if it doesn't tell me I got the check mark on Colin Baloney. But I think we're fine. Yep, there it is, very cool. So, let's move on to the next level, which is Chaos in the Grand Labyrinth. And these labyrinth levels are a bit of a stress for me. They've been tough in the past, but this one looks very cool. I mean, the last, like the final labyrinth that looked endless, but wasn't endless, was really tough. Previously, we had to get that done. Um, oh my, and it's been a while since I've last done one of these. I sort of forget how they're done, to be honest with you. Oh, got you, yeah. Oh, I see, so you, let us out. Well, thank you very much. And I'm sure there's gonna be some kind of bonus challenge to get a certain amount of coins or something. So I'll do what I can to get all those, uh, whatever coins I really can. Right now, there hasn't been too many. I wonder how many lives I can gain doing this kind of stuff. Not really sure at the moment, but this could be like the majority of the episode right here is just figuring this stuff out. So I'll do what I can. We'll go as far as we can go. And hopefully everything will turn out quite well. Got it? There we go. And then turn around and boom. I didn't see any coins around there, so I think I'm good on level number four. I mean, hey, maybe this one will be a bit easier. I just don't know. But it does look very cool. So what will you give me? You'll give me some kind of box, but what is it? Does the other guy give me a box? Is he gonna give me something else? I gotta go catch him first, I suppose. Um, oh no, getting, oh, come on, really? That was sort of baloney. Can I just catch you? You are actually being really not so helpful here. There we go. Can I slow him down? No, I can't. Come on, I'm gonna get you. There it is, there it is, there it is. I mean, I wasn't really running as fast as I could either. I've been trying to keep a good pace. Uh, there we go, we made our way through. Ooh, look at this. Is the mummy gonna be chasing me around here? I suppose not. So I can grab all of this stuff nice and easy. Very cool. Don't see anything else around here, so we got everything. 152 coins in total so far. Now we got shy guys to deal with, and the shy guys are gonna chase me too, so gonna have to work with that. Got it, okay. So I'm gonna go all the way around again and wait for him to do something. It looks like he just keeps going in big circles. There's only one way for him to go now. It's gonna be here. Okay, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. In the box, let's go. Oh boy, we're at 180 coins. So I really hope it isn't something like crazy and insane. Oh, come on, you jerk. <laughs> I don't appreciate that, you're so mean. I didn't do anything to you. I'm just trying to make my way through. Uh, I'm guessing, I mean, I know the original was like, what, a thousand coins we had to get or something ridiculous like that? Don't know if that'll be the case here. I, I hope not, but you never know. All right, see, I just gotta dodge this stuff and keep moving as much as I can, as fast as I can, as often as I can. Don't just let them walk right into us. That would be bad. I'm thinking this situation's pretty bad. I might have to just skedaddle. Where is he, where is he? Get him. Go around, go around, go around, go around. Okay, I made it. Oh boy, now there's a couple of them just waddling around, digging underground. Okay, come on, give me a mushroom. No, I walked right into him, what's wrong with me? Ah, come on. Uh, well, I gotta do it again. <laughs> that is not good. Uh, I'm gonna keep trying though, for sure. Grab it. And we were at like number eight. So as long as I just keep getting coins, I'm sure we'll get there okay. Make sure if I uh, can to just Get yeah, whatever extra. Got some stuff there. Like so far, like it really is quite tame. Just 16 coins in total so far. Let me, oh boy, that's a problem. I'm getting him, got him. 
Because right now it's just stationary piranha plants. It gets real difficult when it becomes a shy guys. Got it, okay. Keep going, keep going. Oh boy, I don't like that. Pull this out, and we're good. Because it was like, what, number five that had the, the mining pickaxe? Maybe not. We'll find out. Okay, grab all the coins first. That seems to be all of them. So I'm gonna turn back around and start working on you. You're going to be the one who gives me the exit. The other guy is gonna give me the mushroom, which I would love to take, oh, just to get an extra 10 coins. Hopefully I don't immediately need the mushroom right after picking it up. Okay, number five, yeah. So if we could get to number 10, I'm sure there's gonna be another little break. Got it. Awesome, so we got a 50 coins there, an extra 10 there. We're good to keep moving. Get all these shy guys to leave me alone as much as I possibly can. No, no, no. Okay, this little mole's driving me nuts. He's never in the position I need him to be. Leave me alone, leave me alone. Where's he gonna be now? He's over there. He is over there. Okay, okay. Yeah, let these guys go all the way around. Ooh, come on close. Ay, ay, ay. I mean, I try to just sneak around these dudes. It's never easy. We're at 195, 205, 210. Pretty good, pretty good. All right. Oh, okay, I didn't even really mean to do it that way. That's just sort of the way it worked out. And now we're back here. Grab that. That's gonna be my exit to this level, so if I just wanna grab some coins real quick and skedaddle, now we're on number nine. Okay, and this is where I failed before. That's a pickaxe, ooh, this could be good actually. Go for it, get these guys out of there. And I could destroy the dude with the pickaxe, you. There you go, that gave me a couple coins too. I like it. Excellent, so I'm gonna go ahead and, yeah, grab that, go through, and we're at number 10, so I get some extra bonus stuff right over this way. Very cool, so now we're at 376, 386, so I can talk to you. Will you give me anything? No, you're just hanging out. I like the little Kamek statue, I think it was a shy guy last time. Oh, are you following me now? Oh, I don't know if that's a good thing. Oh, you're giving me bunches of extra coins. Oh, and that's why it's giving me a Kamek. Okay, so the statue's gonna give me a little bit of a heads up on what's coming up next. So if I just keep him following me for as long as I possibly can, I'm gonna get a lot of coins. This guy, he has a lot for us. I appreciate that. I'm gonna freeze him too. Like, this is a lot of multitasking I'm doing right now. I'm aiming at the Kamek, I'm pressing a button to stun him. I'm running around, I'm trying to catch up to this mole so I can pull him out of the ground. I think it might just be smart. <laughs> I don't think I'm making too much headway on him. Oh, here we go, here we go, no! There we go, I got him. But I, this guy stopped giving me coins, what gives? Will he start giving me some more? Oh, he will, each area looks like more coins for us. Very cool, freezing you. Definitely for as long as possible. Look at how many coins there are over this way. That is insane. Okay, okay. Gotta grab this, and then we've gotten all the coins we can really get, I think. Um, that's it, that's it. Freeze this dude for as long as possible. Oh, that is difficult to multitask with, but I made it work, I made it work. Go, 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 go. Whoa, we're moving. And there's two of them now. Gonna be much more challenging to freeze two of them. I mean, it's not really possible to freeze two of them at the same time. No, what did he, I guess he got. He must have got hit by Kamek. Like, that's a shame, but we did keep him for a while. Luckily, we don't get knocked out for him being gone. All right, that guy just gave me some coins. Uh, this guy, and that guy gave me the exit. Oh, that is so unfair. Luckily, we get a mushroom back, and I can turn around and grab him. He gave me a pickaxe, it's sort of a bad time. I'll try it out. I don't know if there's gonna be anything I can really find. I can get a couple of extra coins for doing that. I can't hit these dudes. So yeah, my best bet is just to leave now. I have the chance. Sort of just bad luck I found him last. We're at 15 already. That was actually pretty quick. So now we got the yellow guy. Wonder if I could have chained them all up for some insane coin action. So now we're dealing with all these birds, I suppose. That'll be interesting. Yeah, if you could join me though, that'd be great. And let's get going, my friend. We got a place to go. Yeah, these birds are sort of flying overhead. Honestly, a lot less scary. I mean, probably a bit more difficult if we had the green dude. That's for sure, especially since they all slam down at once. That's not easy. Oh, I almost got him, almost got him. So I'm gonna try to sort of go the opposite direction. Maybe I can just catch him in his pathway. Right here, excellent. Turn it around. Oh my gosh, almost got slammed. Let's see how long we can last with this guy. I really wanna last a while. There we go, there we go. Turn him back around, because there's a pile of coins over this way. 
I can certainly grab. Okay, here he is. That was actually quite easy, but we're not quite done. I still have more coins I can grab, and you better bet I'm gonna grab them. There's another one up for us. Yeah, we're gonna get 99 lives. No problem now. We're at 84. We were at only like 60 before, so like we're doing crazy good. Come on, keep going, keep going. Can't let this slide by. Watch it! Oh no. Come on now, come on. Way over this way, what do we got? Bunches of coins. So we, I just gotta find the little mole. He's over that way. This one didn't give me as many coins, that's for sure. Uh, that's okay. Ready, got him. Excellent, keep going, turn it around, boom. Okay, this one has multiple, it's the 19th round. What'll this be? That's just coins. Oh no, ah, oh, there goes my little buddy. There's the exit though. And well, I guess it's the 19th round, so we're about to make our way out. It would've been cool to have two of them. I don't know if if you can even get two of them. Maybe he'll just give you a reward. Oh, now I'm getting hit because there's too many things around. Okay, no, I didn't mean to leave yet. Oh, well, fun's over. Now we got ghosts and bullet bills. My, oh my, that's gonna be interesting. Okay, I'm not quite done though. Got this stuff to do. Oh, uh, right out of time. That sort of stinks, but that's fine. I still got the mushroom and the gold mushroom out of it, which are the two big things. Got it, and boom, <laughs> pretty cool. I'll just grab the rest here, shouldn't it be too bad? Maybe I could have gotten more if it was the pickaxe getting it, but hey, we got over 2,000 coins now. I hope the goal isn't like 5,000 coins or something crazy, it could be though. So I gotta dodge ghosts now, that's not fun. At some point there's gonna be bullet bills. I don't like it, I really don't like it. Especially since they sort of you know phase through the walls in a way that's hard to really see sometimes the mole hides under the ghosts. This is a tough combo. Got him, okay, I was hoping I could cut him off like that, sort of my best bet a lot of the time. And we just sort of have to be very observant, very careful. That's a very hard combo to make happen when we're, we're also being chased by a mummy toad. Got it, all right, level 23. After this we have level 24 and then another uh, re relaxing room. That'd be great right about now. Don't hit the blue toad. Come on, he's precious. There we go, there's the exit. So you, this, no, that stinks. Oh well, better hit him, him than us though, right? I and mean, we gotta make our way through here if we don't wanna have to redo the whole level. Let me grab you. That might be, oh, that is the exit. Okay, that could be good. Let me snag as many coins as I can, but let's do it safely, if I can manage. A lot of the ghosts are over this way, so I'm just gonna grab these. Grab those. Okay, okay. Not bad. Nice, okay, we're making it work. Wait right here for just a moment, and boom, we're good. Now we have bull bills, so there was no relaxing room on the fifth one this time. I guess it's maybe only every 10 rooms now. Or maybe it was always, no, it was not always every 10 rooms, but it is now, and that's what matters. Okay, ready, grab them. Keep going, and go through. I don't think there was any other coins over there. I feel like the bullet bills, or at least for Captain Toad to dodge, um, are easier than the, uh, the ghosts, because the ghosts just sort of pop out of nowhere. You always know where the bullet bill's gonna show up, you know? It has a certain rhythm to it, that the bullet bill shooters are stationary, so it, it's at least easier for Captain Toad to dodge, that maybe if we had a little straggler behind us, that might be difficult to you know make our way through some of these tighter areas. Whoa. Let me grab that. Keep on moving over this way. I do see that little mole. The mole makes everything so much more complicated in this level. I got him, I just barely got him there. Whoop, and we're good. Okay, level 28. The music keeps getting higher and higher with each area we go to, at least a pitch of it. Okay, got him. There actually isn't really any coins in this one. That was sort of weird. Okay, but there's so many moles and no bullet bills. Okay, here's the big difference. All right, bunches of coins, bunches of other stuff. It's a little ridiculous. Maybe we're about to hit the end. I'm not really sure there's the pickaxe. Why is that always the last thing I find? I don't know. Something's just silly with me, I guess. There we go. And we did it, we got to the end. How amazing is that? Let's definitely get as many things as we can get here. Very cool, very cool. Yeah, we completed the crown. Let me grab that and just get the last of this crown over this way. Very cool, golden mushrooms galore. We're gonna be all the way up to 3,695, 3,745, 3,795, okay, so not quite 4,000, but hi, Toadette, how are you? <laughs> Very good, let's go ahead and pick up the final wonderful pink crown. So is this the Peachette crown? <laughs> sort of, kind of, right? Okay, 
Well, there we go, we did it. We completed the special episode DLC and it looks like we get the same credits as always, I suppose, just with a slightly different crown. <laughs> That's interesting for sure, I had a lot of fun with that. Now, we still might have to redo that entire thing to get all the coins. I sure hope not, because while I had fun with it, that, that was enough. <laughs> but yeah, that was a fun foray through the special DLC episode. I hope they do this more, not just with Captain Toad, but honestly, if they could add DLC to basically every major game they're released on the Switch at this point, I would be absolutely Happy, very happy. You know, Mario Odyssey, Mario Odyssey, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, Captain Toad Treasure Tracker, Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. These kind of games, I really want to see DLC for all of it because these games are so wonderful. You just, I would love more of all of them. They've been a blast. So hopefully you guys enjoyed me playing this because obviously if there's any more Captain Toad Treasure Tracker content that comes out, I will certainly play that for you guys as well. Uh, but yeah, this was a really fun game for us in 2018. Uh, one of the most popular series I did in 2018. And if you're excited for more Nintendo action, there's more coming up later this year. We have Mario Maker 2, Luigi's Mansion 3, and Animal Crossing all coming to the Nintendo Switch. I'm super excited for all three of them. And even other stuff like uh, Link's Awakening, The Legends of the Link's Awakening coming out as a remaster on the Switch later in 2019. Lots of cool Nintendo stuff coming up super duper soon. So I hope you're excited for it. Uh, looks like the credits are now done. <laughs> awesome. A lot of people have been asking me if, uh, I plan on playing this game's counterpart, Super Mario 3D World, where Captain Toad sort of originated. Uh, I do eventually, I'm hoping it gets poured to the Switch. Yeah, there we go, we returned the crown. Thanks for playing. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> they actually said it. That's pretty cool. Okay, so, don't know what else is gonna go on here. I just wanna see if I get the check mark, you know? Cleared with all the, oh no, that's impossible. Oh, I don't even know if I want to do that one. Because <laughs> there's the end of the book. Oh, what's going on now? It just brings me back to the uh, main menu. Oh, man. I don't know if I even want to do that. That doesn't even sound like fun. I mean, if, if you're curious about what I would get, if you look on the uh, little three Captain Toad badges on these books, you might notice there's a star around, or stars around each of them. And then here there is not. That's what I get for getting all the bonus checks, I think. I could try it once, and if it works, awesome. If it doesn't, I really don't want to put myself through that headache. It sounds so difficult to do that. I was hoping it would be like a coin requirement. Absolutely not. <laughs> oh, that would stink. So I'm just gonna not worry about the coins, because I thought that, that's sort of the thing. I went through all that work to get the coins, thinking that that would matter, because I don't need lives at this point. Look, we're already at 99. I mean, obviously I've played this content, meaning that I've played all the content there is to play in the game at this point, you know? I've even gotten all the time trials for all the main levels, and I don't think these levels even have, you know, specific times to beat. You don't really get anything for it, but <laughs> we did that anyways. Uh, we're gonna move down this way, go, go, go. Yeah, we played everything you can play in Captain Toad Treasure Tracker last year. It was a ton of fun. I really did enjoy it, but like, I can't even get through this without getting hit. You think I'm gonna be able to get somebody to join me and have them not get hit? Well, it ain't gonna happen. So I'm gonna try it one time. If 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 we get if we lose a single uh, member of it, I'm giving up. It just I don't know. It's just something I'm not really. It just doesn't sound very fun to me. So I hope everybody understands. But I don't think you really unlock anything for it. <laughs> so you know I'm not too worried. Uh, you know if we if 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 I find out later that we do, then I'll just make an extra episode. I don't mind. We've made quite a few of these episodes. This is the 24th episode in the series. Yeah, we played quite a lot of uh, Captain Toad. It's been fun. And hopefully we'll have more fun if they ever add more DLC. Or if I ever feel like playing the co-op mode at some point. Which I don't currently, but maybe one day. See, now this feels nice. Just being able to do that. Which I could have done that sooner. Let me grab that. And then I am talking to you, sir. Yep, that's it. Come with me. And I'm gonna use this pickaxe for as much and as long as I can so that I can, boom, and then go, 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 go. Thank you. Run, run, run. The best thing we can do is stun Kamek and find this dude. There he is, there he is, there he is. It's just not easy no matter what. Oh, come on, yep, okay, I'm done. I have no more interest in it. It is just not for me. <laughs> but hey, I had fun with the rest of the DLC. We had an absolute blast. Um, the only thing I really can do is more coins galore. I think that there was the other side of the mini game I haven't quite done, even though I know it's sort of the same as before. Uh, we might as well do this one, because I haven't done it in a while, so I'm gonna get started with that. Also get extra 10 coins, because why not? We'll try this out, we'll have a good time, and then we'll be done. 
So yeah, let's get the, the, all of the cherry as I can, and then we're just gonna, the, what we're supposed to do, as you can see, is pull up as many of these as we possibly can. And it's working out pretty well. Oh, and then we get the pickaxe. Oh man, if I knew there was a pickaxe, we could have done so much better there. <laughs> oh, 188 coins isn't worth complaining about. Apparently our best coin run, I don't know about that. But there we have it. There was the special episode DLC in three episodes, getting all 48 gems. I had a ton of fun, hopefully you did too. But with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. If you watched this point of video, make sure you comment Captain Zebra Sunny. If you watched at the end of it, you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.